Tatties, and you're watching Transmissions Live. Thank you, ladies. Watching Transmissions Live, we're here with the Hot Toddies from Tricycle Records' third compilation record release party live at the brick and mortar. I said that in one breath. <laughs> Hot Toddies are Heidi, Aaron, and Sylvia. What's uh, up? You guys are from Oakland, California. Yes, we are. Yes. Mm -hmm. okay. Right on. You can find out more about them at hottoddiesmusic.com. You're on Facebook, Twitter, Bandcamp, and tricycle-records.com. Yep, all that. And this is the new. So you guys got a new song on mm -hmm. the compilation, mm -hmm. and this was your last album here, correct? Yeah. Yes, okay. it is. Talk mm -hmm. about 
Well, let's talk about the, the new song. How did that, how'd that come about and how did you hook up with Price Core Records? Nice. Um, yeah, this new song is kind of a new direction we're going. We used to play with Keyboard Player, uh -huh. so she just recently moved away to Europe, which is awesome. So we kind of um, have been exploring our sound as just a three-piece. Okay. So this is a little bit more to our like blues punk roots, yeah, you know? Kind of garagey, a little rougher. A little, faster, yeah, a little louder. rougher on the edges, <laughs> which we kind of like. <laughs> so we're hoping that's kind of the direction we're going in, but this song took that form. So um, yeah, it's a simple little song, but we like to rock out with it. It's so, nice to uh, radios. Listen, to it. <laughs> nice. it just came Thanks. out the other day. Or yeah, yeah, yeah so, we just so recorded it. So yeah, and we're releasing it on the Tricycle Records comp, so okay. it should be good. Cool. Um, good stuff. Let's talk about Bottoms Up. How that EP? <laughs> when was this release? This earlier? It's a little earlier. I mean, I think we wrote a lot of the songs you know, different stages, and then um, just kind of decided to put it together as an EP. Um, so we were really excited about all the songs. Instead of waiting to write more, we just wanted to get it out there. So <laughs> it's one of our, it's the last release we had with um, our keyboard player. Okay. But um, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Some of the old stuff that we're into, like kind of surfy stuff, but then some funky, like, we wrote a song about baseball. We wrote a song about baseball. Right. <laughs> Oakland days, all the way. <laughs> Just all the different parts of our lives. So. All right. <laughs> Thank you. 
you guys connect? How did you guys first hook up? So we met through all of our, well, ex-boyfriends and and not ex-boyfriends, but we met through boys, <laughs> and then we decided to stay together through it all. So. Um, <laughs> My ex-boyfriend went to college with Heidi, and then her boyfriend, very confusing. Anyway, <laughs> we, uh, we were all friends with a lot of guys in bands, and there were always tons of guy bands, and we thought we should just have a girl band because girls are fun to hang out with. And surprisingly, I think that we actually are way less drama than any of the boy bands that we know. <laughs> we get along great, we love each other, and they're always having little fights. Yeah, I think so. we've survived longer than some of their bands yeah. have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We all kind of learned our instruments to be in this band. Yeah. So our first songs were very, very simple. We were learning, you know. Yeah. Aaron and I wrote a few, just the two of us, and then we met Sylvia. We're like, do you play anything, anything <laughs> at all? You know, she's like, well, I can learn. I'm like, well, you're in the band no matter what. Just, just learn how yeah, to play something. Basically you're in just the called band. the drums. So I was like, called it, and then... Yeah, she went, went away there. for a summer and learned the drums and came back. We were like, yeah, <laughs> totally in. So we mainly have this great friendship, and through that we play music. And, but definitely, like, sisters first. Yeah. <laughs>